Right now, 11th Ward Alderman Tuffy Quinones died yesterday at 76 after being hospitalized due to a stroke last week. 13 WREX's Emily McMahon was able to speak with some of his fellow aldermen today. Yeah, Emily, what has been the reaction from his colleagues? His fellow aldermen have expressed to me just how special Tuffy Quinones was both as an alderman and as a friend and how missed he will be. They also shared about his attention to small businesses and how much he cared about not just his ward, but Rockford as a whole. April Prunty is in her first term as the alderman for District 6. She says Tuffy Quiones was a leader and big part of helping her transition into the role. I'm sure he took all of us newbies under his wing, but I know that he did me and he um, took me around and introduced me to people that, um, who he knew in um, my ward. Prunty is also a teacher at Roosevelt Community Education Center. She says even her students knew of Alderman Tuffy. It was funny because my students, um, even they would talk about they <laughs> Some of them aren't even eligible to vote, so I teach at Roosevelt. Some of them, um, they just were aware of his work. Alderman Jonathan Logeman's second ward shared a border with Keonis's 11th. Logeman tells us what working together was like, as well as some of their typical interactions. We shared a boundary, um, kind of his eastern boundary and my southwestern boundary. Um, so, you know, we'd always check in on each other and see how we were doing. And I always remember, like, every council meeting, he would always say, you know, hey, Logeman, how's it going, you know? Um, you know, we're always doing good work for the people, and that's, that's who he was. Alderman Mark Booney shares more about Kiones and the future of the 11th Ward. I think, you know, he'll, he, was, um, he was a character, Tuffy was a character, and he will be a hard act to follow for whoever fills his shoes representing the 11th Ward. Tuffy Kionis has been a member of City Council since 2017. Brittany, Derek. All right, thank you, Emily.